as spring temperatures melt snow in high elevations, Cache Creek is growing and threatening properties in the community named after it. This is the lovely Cache Creek, which the town was named after, roaring behind us. It's usually a very nice little creek. So we're, we're used to the creek flooding the last uh, two, three years, but it's generally much earlier. So we were a little unprepared. It was Saturday early evening that the residents alerted the mayor to the water levels. The mayor declared a state of local emergency on Saturday night around 7 o'clock, and we determined that uh, the people along the creek needed to be put on alert. That involved about uh, 10, 11 properties. We determined that we needed to put them on alert just in case we had to evacuate them, which we did last night around nine o'clock. So 10 properties are under evacuation order at the moment. That includes a campground RV park and two motels. There are still two other properties that are under alert only. We don't expect a problem with them, but it's just being safe. So we have several pieces of uh, large equipment that are, uh, as I say, keeping the, the culvert, the uh, entrances to the culverts as clean as they can. There's a lot of debris washing down. This is the result of snow melt from the uh, hills behind us. Uh, you don't want things building up in front of the culvert because that's a sure sign that the bank is going to overflow or, or slough off and uh, undercut a whole whole raft of problems that you can have. So they're keeping that clean. The uh, the creek is uh, hopefully n near its peak tonight, but after that, I mean, it flows into the Bonaparte River on the other side of the highway. So our attention is going to is is turning to that already. Brendan Kurgan, Castanet Cameras.